Hello Libra and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Man, I'm telling you. Okay, I feel like somebody manipulated you in the past, all right? Um, they saw you as an easy target. They thought that you were in a time of vulnerability, right? Maybe you were um, struggling with something here, uh, struggling with your finances. They manipulated you and used you, okay? And now this person wants to come back around. They see that, the look, now you're the Ten of Pentacles. See, when they used you, um, and manipulated you, you may have not had much to offer this person besides love, you know, but they, they look down on that. They did, maybe didn't think you were enough. I feel like this person thought that they could easily take advantage of you, and now you're in this Ten of Pentacles energy, okay? They've been watching this. They've been watching um, your glow up, all right? Yeah, but they look, they walked away from you. They sabotaged you, walked away. They may have even um, uh, drained your reputation through the mud, okay? Yes. And now how are they going to communicate with you? Now all this person can do is stand from the sidelines and watch you succeed. Whatever idea you had, whatever you've been putting your effort into, it's, it's becoming a success. The seeds that you've planted before, all of that hard work, all of your patience, it's going to pay off. Or it already is, because this person is watching it. Okay? There could have been somebody else in the picture that they chose instead of you. I feel like that person is watching you pretty close, too. Um, yeah, and they're doing a lot of fighting about this behind the scenes. So what is this? This is like the holidays for this person. You know, they're thinking back on how they treated you. Then it's made it really hard for this person to come back in now, <laughs> right? You could have been dealing with a Sagittarius, a Virgo, um, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And if they chose somebody over you, all those people are doing this this weekend is fighting, okay? Um, there's a masculine that doesn't even want to be where they are right now. They just want to be secluded. They don't want to be around anybody, okay? There's going to be a lot of fighting that pops off. Yeah, and look, they're going to be lashing out at people. They're gonna, they may even be acting like a fool or somebody else um, lashes out at them. What is this? There could be a fight that pops off this weekend with your person and whoever else they're with that the police are called in. I feel like the police are called in. You know, all this person wants to do is be alone. Um, yeah, someone could actually be taken to jail. I, I'm getting the sense that they're fighting over you and money, okay? And the somebody here possibly gets taken to jail. Because they're feeling pretty sabotaged, pretty um, betrayed by whoever they're currently with, Okay. And you've got nothing to do with this. I feel like, no, nope, I don't want to be a part of that one. Yeah. The police are called in, I feel, on this person. That some kind of massive fight goes down. It could even be with family. It's multiple people fighting. So family members are going to chime in. So this is a Christmas celebration. All we've got are swords out here. And look at this is their this is what's happening on their holidays for real fighting betrayal backstabbing them thinking about what they did to you the karmic freaking out fighting with this person because they're uh, competing with you somehow and I feel like um, 
you know, you may be you may be spending the holidays at home. You know, uh, you could even be alone for the holidays. I'm kind of getting the sense that this person may have to sit in some kind of jail cell in the holidays, okay? Um, realizing that everybody around them really doesn't care about them. Yeah, your person could be possibly a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, maybe a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. You could be a Leo. You could be... Um, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I feel like they're, they just, they just want to be alone and secluded so they can think about you. Okay, look, toxic energy and a whole lot of drinking going on. Okay, well, I feel like this person gets absolutely wasted. Okay, um, they're drinking a lot um, on the holidays. Okay, this is all going down this weekend. Um, and it's just toxic energy. This and a fighting, fighting, drinking, jealousy, rage, the police. Somebody may be sitting in a jail cell, go possibly going to jail. You know, and you're going to be out here. You could even work during the holidays, okay? You're in this empress energy. Um, this person is completely obsessed about you as well. They may have some addictions. They may drink. Uh, like, this could be a heavy drinker, okay? I just feel like all this fighting and stuff in the holidays, they kind of can't handle the pressure, and they kind of go off the deep end, okay? They're going off the deep end this holiday. And it's all because of you. You're the only one that they can think of. You're the only one that's on their mind. They don't want to think about anybody else. They may even be stuck in a jail cell somewhere. Or this is either jail or it's stuck in their mind about you. Obsessing, drinking, people popping off left and right, massive fights. This person sees you as their match. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You know, we've got the king to the queen of pentacles out here. They just want to be around you. They may even be um, doing some spying on you. Because look at how they're over here watching you from afar. Do you see that? So this, if you're posting anything on the internet, they're going to they're gonna see it if they're not in a jail cell. Okay, um, they're going to be doing a lot of heavy drinking. Like, this is a lot of drinking. Um, and fighting. Okay, I, I'm getting the sense that they may even, they may have a fight with the karmic this weekend and walk out of maybe a, um, a like a family celebration or something. Because they just want to be alone to think about you and watch you. Yeah, they're going to be having a massive tower moment um, during the holidays, okay? Huge tower moment. They could even be um, asked to leave whatever get-together. If there's a get-together at, at somebody's home, they may be asked to leave it because they're, look, all they want to do is come towards you and apologize. That's it. They want to come towards the star, right? Divine feminine energy, by the way. And say they're sorry. They want to be around you um, during the holidays, okay? I'll have a blue Christmas without you. Yeah, look it. I'll be so blue just thinking about you right you like <laughs> yes i'm telling you they're gonna be feeling heartbroken they're gonna be um carrying a huge burden people are gonna be looking at this person because they're acting way different okay they're not acting themselves at all this weekend or during the holidays um, huge tower moments, knowing they're going to have 
I'll have a blue, 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 blue Christmas, right? Yeah. You could be dealing with the Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius. All they're going to be doing is thinking about you, obsessing about you, a whole lot of drinking and a whole lot of fighting, wondering what you're doing. They may even do some things here that um, this holiday season that they don't want you to know about, that they don't want you to find out about, like ever. I'm getting this embarrassed feeling off of this person. Okay, let's let's check their emotions. You could be a Cancer, Pisces. Yeah, but I'll have a blue, 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 blue Christmas. Yes. They're going to have a really difficult time this holiday season. Okay, very frustrated. Um, beyond frustrated. I mean, I just feel with frustrated coming out in reverse, this person completely loses their cool. Um, they snap on people. They get themselves engaged in, like, big fights. It could even get physical. They can't control their drinking. They're can't, they can't control um, their sadness. They don't want to be around anyone. They know they've wasted too much time. You know, they're going to be maybe praying for a miracle here. Yeah, whatever home situation or, or wherever they're going to be in, I'm telling you, a storm is sure to follow. This is a karmic storm right outside the, their window. Okay? So, yeah, there's going to be a major shakeup somewhere. And this person's going to end up, like, hoping for a miracle in a whole lot of regret. Look at Something's going to pop off. All right, somebody is so stressed out, they just can't get control of themselves, okay? They're completely out of control, and all they're doing, like, all they want to do is kind of be in this hermit energy, right? Um, doing a lot of praying, wanting to kind of be alone, isolate themselves, longing for you, crying, they may even look at some of your old photos over the holidays. They're, they're feeling really sad and sorry for how they've treated you, for how they've um, used you, let you go. This, is, this player is going insane this weekend, okay? This is a person who played you and manipulated you, and they knew what they were doing, okay? They're going to be watching you from afar, Maybe even under a fake profile because they're going to be hiding this. I feel like this person kind of hides away in another room and takes out their phone and looks you up on the internet, looks at your photos, tries to find out what you're doing for the holidays this year. Okay? And I feel like they can't. You're, you're keeping your moves hidden. They're feeling hopeless. Look at all of the, look at their emotions are completely out of control. Completely out of control. And I feel like there could even be a, a karmic relationship that goes down um, during the holidays. Okay. It just feels like people are getting their karma. This person feels very closed in, very like they're being swallowed up by emotions okay yeah that out of control out of control that's how they're gonna be like total chaos extremely emotional okay they're gonna go from being angry and having a hissy fit and stressed out to a lot of crying um it's gonna be maybe a busy time for them but i'm feeling them more like wanting to be on shutdown mode Okay, yeah, they feel more like this. They just want to be left alone so they can feel sorry for themselves and lick their wounds. You know, so this person who once played you and thought they could get away with it felt all kinds of powerful, powerful enough to take advantage of somebody in a vulnerable place. Okay, 
now feels like this, empty inside. Maybe they're looking at themselves like they're even heartless. For real. They're going to be taking a look at themselves. All right? And they're going to be, um, their emotions will be out of control. Yeah, let's see what else. Yeah, and you're leaving their life. You're leaving them behind. Just cover up this word. Look. You're you're done. You're leaving this player behind like a ponytail in the wind. The, they never apologized. They didn't try to do anything to make anything right. Okay? Um, they, I, all you know is that this person played you and used you. That's all you know. Okay? And they may even see here's that event, right? I, I feel like this person is, they could even possibly show up at your house. They could, if they're not in jail. They may show up at your house. Um, you'll be shocked if this happens. Yeah, see, I feel like, here's the thing. I feel like this is sort of runner chaser energy, okay? Um, I feel like you're very confident, very high vibing taking off, leaving their life, leaving this person behind, making bold, courageous moves for yourself, okay? And I see them freeing themselves from a prior commitment and coming towards you. This is what they want. And they may even show up at your event, at your home, wherever you are, okay? But, yeah, um, I see them not wanting to be where they are at all, whether that's just in a karmic home or um, in jail, right? They, they could go to jail as well because this person's going to be super drunk and flying off the handle if anybody tries to mess with them. Like, they just want to be left alone. They don't want this. This doesn't look very Christmassy to me, Right. Right? They're not really in the holiday spirit. They just want to be left alone, okay? So that they can feel sorry for themselves, lick their wounds, and, and think about how they were heartless to you. You know, I feel like this person just wants to get away. I'm hearing, I want to get away. I want to get away. <laughs> I don't know who sings that song, but yeah. So they're planning on, or they may... Free themselves and come towards your house or wherever you're going to be. Um, oh, man, those they're very ashamed of how they treated you. They feel very unworthy. Like I said, I feel like this person is thinking to themselves that they were heartless. They feel heartless here. Okay. And I feel like now they want to come and make it right. Now they want to spend the holidays with you, okay? But now it's, I feel like it's too late. Yeah, look, they're ashamed of themselves, man. They're doing a lot of crying in private. I feel like they, they go in another room away from a group and they cry. And somebody comes to check on them. Like, what are you doing? Get out here with the rest of the party, right? And they don't want to. They don't want to be there. Um, yeah, they're crying over you. They're crying over you and the loss of you um, during the holidays, during this weekend. Okay. Let's see what your oracles have to say. They're going to be feeling sorry for themselves, but they're also going to. They're kind of. They're blaming themselves here. They're ashamed of what they did. They feel unworthy because they, they were heartless to you. Yeah, they just want to come back around. Look at this. And we are in a retrograde, you guys. This is a retrograde. We're smack dab in the middle of it. Okay, it doesn't end until January 1st, I think. And this is when people from your past want to come back around. And the added pressure and stress, um, this is the pressure and the stress from the holiday season. Okay, um, it's just, it's too much. Yeah, see, they want to come back around 
and they want to apologize and bring some peace between you. They can't stand this anymore. They can, and they can't control anything about themselves right now. Yeah, here they come. Okay, I can't make it up. This masculine wants to go the distance. They're going to reach a point where, yeah, and you're walking away. Look, or at least this is what they want. You're walking away. You've got other opportunities coming to you. Okay? Yeah, it's time to go. I feel like you're releasing this connection and you're, you're moving on. Um, and they're coming in to chase. Oh, they're coming in hot. Okay. They want to make this right. They want to make up. They want to reunite. Whatever. Um, yeah, you're blessed. You can feel this energy. You may be very, um, like, in a meditative state this weekend or during the holidays. Very kind of chill. Maybe you're keeping to yourself as well. Okay, yeah. Use your intuition because this person is about to come back towards you. Okay, they're manifesting this. They're possibly making a plan here to come back in your direction. They're choosing a path. They know what they want. They want you. Um, they're not going to trust these other people anymore. Because I feel like somebody's going to end up calling the police on them or um, try to maybe even intervene to get them to stop drinking or something like that. There's going to be a big fight. But yeah, this person's coming back around. They're wishing for you. They're going to be chasing you um, during this holiday season and stalking you online, right? Yeah. Yeah. They want to come in and tell the truth. They want to do what Spirit has been trying to lead them to do this whole time. Okay, Spirit's been leading them here. And it's finally happening. Okay, it's finally happening here. They're coming in. They're taking the mask off. They're going to be telling you the truth. So get ready, Collective, because they're coming in really fast. I feel like this is going to surprise you. I'm getting the sense that this person is going to just show up at your house. Okay, maybe they know that you're going to be home for the holidays and they're just going to show up. But um, yeah, it's, it's really happening. 